Hi everyone and welcome to my channel. My name is Teresa Ellen Arianis, T-E-A, and this is Tea Time Adventures on YouTube. And what time is it? It is the Walmart Beauty Box time. This is the spring edition and I have version V4. And this is such an inexpensive sub box that honestly, if you ever wanted to get into sub box but were afraid to, to try, this is super super affordable. It's less than $8 per quarter. Comes out four times a year. It's, it's I think, $7.98, something like that. It's something ridiculously low. It's less expensive than Ipsy. So let's go ahead and see what's in the box. I have not peeked. I've just cut off the saran wrap sort of thing, plastic covering. So this is what we see inside. We've got a little card. Now the card doesn't tell you exactly what is in your box, but it tells you the possibilities of what could be in your box. And it is ready for me time. Get your spring off to a glowing start with a fresh crop of beauty picks for skin, body, and hair. Shop these favorites and find ingredient information at walmart.com slash beauty box. Each box contains at least five picks. Assortments will vary based on your beauty profile. It is a very loose beauty profile, but I think I'm listed under mature. So again, um, spring refresh beauty box. They've got uh, a few little advertisements on the back and then inside it tells you the possibilities of what you might get. And sometimes you get stuff that's not even on this list. Surprise! So let's see. The tissue is very pale white. So let's see. The first thing I see is CoverGirl Clean Cover. And it is an eyeshadow palette. It is a four quad. I don't know if you can see that. Shades will vary. And this is considered full size. It is $9.98. So we do have, I think, one matte, a sparkle, um, a shimmer, and then a glitter. So they're, I guess you would say, in the brown zone. Um, I don't generally wear these these type of colors, so this might go in a future giveaway, or I might try it. I don't know. I've got brown eyes, so let's see. But that's a nice thing, a full-size product that's $10. That's well above and beyond what this sub box costs. So, um, very nice indeed. The next item is... Number 7, Future Renew Damage Reversal Day Cream with Sunscreen Broad Spectrum SPF 25. Um, and it's suitable for sensitive skin. Let's see, is this even on here? I did not see it on here. So again, something on here that uh, that I get in my box. Oh, wait a minute. No, it's just the picture's different. Um, this is a sample size, which is 5 mil or 0.16 fluid ounces. A full size, which is 0.84 ounces, basically three quarters of an ounce, would be $27.98. So we've got a little five mil sample right here. Um, I don't generally wear SPF stuff. I'm 99.999% never in the sun. So I don't feel the need to put something on my face when I'm never going to use it. <laughs> Uh, and I don't feel like I need it. I'm indoors 100% of the time in a department that doesn't have any windows and only has one door that faces an interior hallway. I usually have my blinds closed, so <laughs> again, something that I can pass on to somebody else. The next thing that I see in here is Whole Blends, Garnier's Whole Blends Shampoo Bar, 94% plant-based restoring honey treasures. Now, actually, I'm excited about this. Why? Because I use Garnier's Honey Treasures shampoo and conditioner, and it does do a really good job with help repairing damage on hair. I've been losing my hair as, as part of like the hormonal shift of a mature woman. I don't know about that, but you know, older woman, whatever. Um, so this is um, Restoring Solid Shampoo Bar. It is considered a full size. Smells nice, definitely. Um, and the full size product right here is worth $7.97. Again, this product alone pays for the bucks, let alone the uh, four quad eyeshadow palette. Um, so I think that was something definitely fun to try. 
The next thing is Dove Advanced Care, uh, one quarter moisturizers with natural oils. It is a dry um, deodorant antiperspirant combo spray. I believe it looks like it is in Cool Essentials, which looks like it looks like cucumber. I detest cucumber. Um, so again, something that might be uh, given away. So um, again, I don't see it on here. Oh, no, it is. Again, um, this can't be a full size. A full size is 3.8 ounces. This is one ounce. A full size is 7.48. So we got a couple dollars worth of uh, antiperspirant slash deodorant. Let's see. The last thing I see in here looks like it is a very, uh, like a foil pack sample. Neutrogena Hydro Boost Water Cream. I actually like this. I think I got a sample of it in a giveaway that I won from Carol Gardner. So I like that. Um, let's see. Neutrogena Hydro Boost Cream Face Moisturizer with Hyaluronic Acid. Now this is 0.11 fluid ounces, three mil. A full size would be a, let's see, full size would be 1.7 uh, ounces, which would be worth $22.97. So I'm looking forward to using this too. I know a lot of people don't like foil samples, but I do, and I honestly think I got a sample of this different packaging from Carol Gardner's giveaway that I won not too long ago. So looking forward to that. And that's what I, that I've won. They have Dove products, Neutrogena products. It would have been nice to get a Vitamask face mask, but I didn't get that. Shampoo bar I'm actually excited about because it's a brand and a scent that I use. Um, there would have been a John Frieda Ultra Filler Thickening Shampoo and Conditioner Combo. That was not in there. We got the CoverGirl uh, Four Quad Eyeshadow Palette. We got the Number 7 Future Renew Damage Reversal Day Cream with SPF 25. Again, the giveaway item. Palmer's Coconut Oil Amino Bonding Complex Bonding Conditioning. I'm assuming it's a hair mask. That would have been nice to try, even though I don't like the scent of coconut. We have a Fortify Rejuvening Protecting Under Eye Pads. Now that would have been nice to get. It would have been $5, five pairs. Um, and Derma E Vitamin C Concentrated Serum. Again, that would have been lovely to have. And Thayer's Let's Be Clear Moisturizer. Now I've tried Thayer's um, Toner before, and that's nice, especially when you get it in the cranberry. Um, but I've never tried their moisturizer. In fact, I didn't even know they made moisturizers. So those are the possibilities that others might get in their box. So it's always worth watching my YouTube ladies when they unbox their beauty boxes for spring of 2024, because they're going to get different items based on their profile. Uh, so do you get this Walmart beauty box? Are we box twins? Leave me a comment down below. What was your favorite item? Was it the water cream, the deodorant, the shampoo bar, the SPF D cream, or the quad palette? Again, there are at least two items in here that blow the price of the box out of the water, completely covered, double, triple the price of what this box is. So you're definitely getting your money's worth. And if you actually have a Walmart in your area, and I do not, the closest is 40 miles south or 55 miles north, so inaccessible to me. Um, but I could always, if I really wanted something, I could go to walmart.com, I could go to target.com, I could probably go to amazon.com as well and find these same products. So that was it. That is my Walmart Beauty Box Spring of 2024. And uh, this is version, version four. So. Thanks so much, everybody, for visiting with me today. I truly do appreciate it. I do have a two-year 800 subscriber giveaway going on. Check the description box for that link. You have to be publicly subscribed. Um, it's open to the United States, Canada, and UK, and it is a $25 gift certificate from Amazon. That's US dollars. It converts to something else for Canada and another dollar amount for the UK. Um, but basically, it's $25. So. Thanks again. I hope you check those out. Give me a thumbs up for positivity. Please take good care of yourselves. Please take good care of each other. And I will see you around the net. Bye.